Hello everyone, welcome to your own channel AutoQuest. My name is Bupinder and guys today I have this Tata Punch EV's middle variant. So this is the Tata Punch Adventure S variant and we are going to cover this variant in this video. But before that, if you are new to our channel, please subscribe our channel and also press the bell icon to get the notification first and also visit our website which is carquestindia.com. Now let's start with the variant first. So there are three variants available, Smart, Adventure and Empowered variant and there are different different packs available with all these three variants but I'll discuss about this adventure variant only in this video. So there is a single pack available with adventure which is adventure S which means this particular car. So I have the adventure S today and we are going to see what features we get with this particular variant. Now the color options. So there are four color options with this variant. With the base variant you will get only a single color option. And with this adventure, you will get four color options. This is the white color. There is a red color available, seaweed green color available, and a gray color available. And if you'll go for the top variant, empowered variant, you will get an extra color option, which is called empowered oxide color. So that was all about the variant and the color options. Now let's check out what features we get in this particular car. Now let's check out the keys of this Punch EV's Adventure S variant first. So you'll get these two smart keys. There is the lock button, unlock button and this is for the follow me headlamps and this is to unlock the boot. Now let's check out the front and look at this Punch EV's front. Looks quite impressive, very nice, beautiful looking car and the width of this vehicle is 1742mm and there is the Tata logo and also this Adventure S comes with these connecting LED DRLs, looks quite impressive, sequential indicators given with this variant. Down there you will get the projector, these LED headlamps and LED fog lamps also available with this variant and under this Tata logo you will see that this part opens and you can charge your Punch EV by using this port. So to open this you will have to press a button which is in the cabin, let me show you. So this is the button, so you'll have to click it and you'll see this is now open and this is the CCS2 port, also supports the fast charging and to close it, you'll have to manually close this door. So this is the Punch EV's front, now let's check out the side of Punch EV. And look at this, this is a micro SUV, looks quite amazing because of this stance and the Punch EV's Adventure S comes with this 16 inches hyper style wheel. This is basically a cover, a black color cover which looks quite amazing. Up there you'll get this rough black finish wheel arc and this rough black finish skirtings given all around the car. There is the EV badge given on the door. The ORVMs are of this glossy black finish and these ORVMs are electrically adjustable and foldable. There are the blinkers and this adventure as comes with the this dual tone roof and rain sensing wipers and automatic headlamps also available with this adventure S pack. Access button given for the driver and up there you'll see this glossy black finish roof rails given and the B pillar and C pillar is of black color. Now let's check out the rear of Punch EV and check out. Looks nice. This is also impressive. Up there you'll get the normal this antenna, this integrated spoiler, high mount stop lamp. There are no defogger wiper washer given for this variant but there is a reverse parking camera and down there you will get the two parking sensors punch ev is written on the hatch and this is the rear tail light look at the design so this extended part looks nice now let me open the boot of this punch ev and to unlock the boot you'll have to press this button only and this boot is unlocked now nice so this is the massive luggage room given with this punch EV. Now let me check the spare wheel and that is the sad part that you will not get any spare wheel with this punch EV but you'll get the toolkit. I don't know what for but you'll get the toolkit with the punch EV. Now let me close the boot and let me enter the car. To open the rear door you'll have to use these handles on the C pillar and the doors open at the 90 degrees. Now let me show you the rear seat comfort. 
So there is ample space here, two, four, four, five mm of wheelbase, and there is good thigh support. And as there is no floor hump, so this floor is straight, so the three people can sit easily on these seats. There are no AC vents for the rear passenger, but there are two headrests, and both the headrests can be adjusted. There is no handrest, and look at the fabric and this texture. This is nice. This is of good quality. Up there, you'll get the grab handles for both the passengers at the rear seat. Now, let me go to the driver's seat. But before that, let me show you the driver door trim. So, there is this black color and this gray green color given on the door trims. All four power windows control are here. This is the controller for the ORVMs. And inner, this door handle is of glossy black finish. Down there, you'll get the bottle holder and uh, umbrella holder also. Adventure S comes with this height adjustable, manual height adjustment for the driver seat is available. Now, let me show you the new steering wheel of Tata Motor, which is nice. D-cut steering wheel. Now, let me start the car once. See, so this Tata logo comes up once you'll start the car. These are the controller. To the right hand side, you'll see cruise control is also available with this variant. And these controllers are for this small DIS. So there is this DIS which has all the information. So you can see, so 35% battery is available right now. And you can see all the information in this driver's display. So this is nice. To the right, you'll see that this push button start is available with these adventure s and adventure variants to the left of the steering wheel you'll see these controllers of the bluetooth connectivity and for this infotainment seven inches this harman infotainment touchscreen available with the android auto apple carplay so this is the touchscreen given for this adventure s variant these are the ac vents down there you'll get the auto ac unit and this looks nice so this AC looks nice. Let me switch off this. Now, let me show you some of the buttons. So if the vehicle is switched off, so you'll see these buttons. So this is to open the charging port. This is to release the charging gun. And this is for the hazardous lights. This is to open the boot. And this is to lock and unlock the all four doors. But once you start the car, the car is ready to drive. So you'll see these two extra buttons here. This is for the hill descent control which is available with this vehicle and this is for the fog lamps. This is also cool. Down there you will see a uh, type charging socket, 12 volt charging socket and there is some space here and look at this knob. So this is the gear knob available and these are the drive modes, sports, eco and the city mode is available. So three drive modes available here. Electric parking brake comes with this variant and a auto hold function also two cup holders given here and there is some space but there is no handrest given for this variant look at this dashboard see the overall design of this dashboard looks quite cool there is the green color given the texture tri arrow pattern is given here now let me open this glove box so there is glove box which is of good size there is the tablet holder and also a light is given for the night usage so that was the glove box up there you'll get the manual day night adjustable irvm and this light is the cabin light the white light given for the cabin vanity mirror for the co-driver but there is no vanity mirror there is a ticket holder for the driver up there you'll get this electric sunroof with this adventure s variant in the upper variant you will get a voice assisted sunroof but this is the normal you'll have to open it through this button so this is electric sunroof so that was all about the features and dimension of this punch ev now let's go out and talk about the safety features power terrain and the pricing of this car but before that let me tell you the charging time for this vehicle so if you have the long range punch ev for that you'll get Two charging options so one is a simple home charging option which will charge this vehicle within the 13.5 hours 13 hours or 14 hours it will get if you'll buy a ac far charger by paying 50,000 extra the charging time will be almost five hours and there is another option which is the dc fast charger available at so many restaurants or hotels right now so through that dc fast charger you can charge this vehicle 10% to 80% within 56 minutes. So that was all about the charging options. Now let's go out and talk about the other things.
Now let's talk about the safety features of this Tata Punch and we all know that Tata makes the most safest vehicle in India right now and this vehicle got the 6 airbags, ABS, AVD traction control, ESP functionalities, reverse parking sensors, all for disc brakes and also the battery got the IP67 rating. Now the powertrain which means the battery pack and the motor which comes with this electric Punch EV. As this is the long range Punch EV adventure as variant, so let's talk about the long range car first. So, with this long range vehicle, you will get a 35 kilowatt hour battery pack and a motor which produces the maximum power of 122 PS and torque of 190 Newton meter. And this particular long range vehicle will give you the range of 421 kilometers, which is the ARI figure. And if you'll go for the medium range punch EV, you will get a 25 kilowatt hour battery pack. With that battery pack also, you will get an electric motor which produces the maximum power of 82 PS and torque of 114 Newton meter. And that medium range punch EV will give you the range of 315 kilometers. That also is the ARI figure. Now the warranty of this punch EV. So for the battery pack, you will get a standard warranty of 8 years or 1,60,000 kilometers. But for the vehicle, you will get a standard warranty of 3 years or 1 lakh kilometers. Now the pricing of this car. So you can see all the prices on the screen and all these prices are the actual prices. The actual price for the long range, this adventure S variant, you will have to pay actual price of 13,49,000 rupees. And for the medium range adventure S variant, you will have to pay 12,49,000 rupees. And there is a 50,000 difference in the adventure and adventure S variant. And for that 50,000 rupees, you will get four features, electric sunroof, automatic headlamps, rain sensing wipers, and this dual tone roof. So that was our video about this Punch EV's Adventure S variant. If you loved this variant, you can comment and tell us about it. Now we will see you in another video. Take care. Bye-bye. Jai